closer look at how the FBI busted a huge nationwide theft ring. Authorities say some of the stolen catalytic converters in the scheme were shipped from Minnesota. Michael George reports. Federal agents swooped into this New Jersey mansion, part of a coordinated nationwide takedown of a crime ring trafficking in stolen catalytic converters. The Justice Department says 21 people were arrested in five states for their roles in the conspiracy, including 13 in Oklahoma. I see uh, huge trucks, guys with, you know, assault rifles or, you know, guns drawn and shields and apprehending some guys. And so after that, it's just, uh, it's been nonstop police presence. It can take less than a minute for thieves to slide under a vehicle and steal its catalytic converter. The devices are part of the exhaust system, converting toxic gas into safer emissions. They also contain precious metals, and the price on the black market can top $1,000 each. The FBI says the stolen converters were shipped to a New Jersey company, which extracted the metals and sold them to a refinery, cashing in for more than $545 million. Hector Ramos works near that New Jersey shop and saw the flow of deliveries. Box trucks coming in and out, and that's it. With the price of metals on the rise, thefts have exploded, soaring more than 1,200% since the pandemic. More than a third happened in California, where in 2021, about 1,600 converters were reported stolen each month. Hey, yo! Earlier this year, David Summer caught two thieves in the act at his Los Angeles home. My security camera alerted me that someone was out front. The FBI hopes this week's arrests will put the brakes on future thefts, saying too many innocent car owners have paid the price. Michael George, CBS News, New York.